Dolly's Pirates Voyage has opened up its holiday show. It is amazing. And Captain Blackbeards is here, uh, also, also known, known as, as Captain Scrooge. Right. I almost didn't want to say it, but not who knows quite right. Okay. Uh, and we're so sorry he knocked down your Christmas tree. Uh, well, I've got my trusty deckhand here to take care yeah. of that sort of yeah. thing. That's why I'm here. Oh, deckhand Ellen Liston, we know well. Well, you yes. know, it's one of those things. He is the captain, and so he can't be doing mundane things like finishing sure. up a Christmas tree. So I had to come along and help. Oh, yeah. Too important, right. Army. Just saying. Well, of course, you have to delegate authority when you're in charge of that many people. Ooh. Yeah. So you all celebrate Christmas. Yes, we do. The pirate uh, show. Actually, uh, there's a, there's, there is a change from um, the Christmas show we opened up during this, or the show we opened up during the summer. Uh, it has leaned now more towards a, you know, a Christmas feel, and you know we like to say to a lot of people wonder actually, you know, do pirates ever like to take a break from plundering and pillaging? And as a matter of fact, we do. In fact, us pirates enjoy Christmas just as much as you do. Huh. All that is, except one, and this be that tale of how one pirate regains his love of Christmas yet again. Oh! Finds the Christmas spirit. Wow! Yeah. So clearly we are. You know, I can we, see why you're the captain. Right. That, you rolled off that off your tongue like it was Bill Shakespeare. <laughs> I'm going to be honest with you. Now, now let me ask you, just from an apparel standpoint, right. the, the, the green part of the outfit, is that just for this it's, particular show? Well, yes, thank goodness. Uh, it's very bright. Uh, I kind of like it. I like it, too. Really? Uh, I do. Yeah, yeah, it's nice I enjoy statement. It. It's, uh, you know, it's very noticeable. Okay. Well, now, it is, and so we were just seeing scenes from the show. I mean, it really is eye-catching, elaborate sets, costuming, mm -hmm. very whimsical. Oh, yes. Well, it's, a lot of work has gone into it, and we have gathered talent from all over the world and uh, trained them all. It's, uh, it's fun with the pirates to watch them transform because you'll have some that know how to dive and then some that know how to tumble, and then they'll bring in somebody to teach all of them how to sword fight, and they'll teach each other how to tumble and how to dive what? and do the, the trampoline wall. Yeah. And, I mean, so, can you teach them how to sword fight and tumble? And Beth, he know, we've sword talked fight. about this. We work, he and I worked in the Atlantic together <laughs> years and years ago. It was a rough I place. I can't teach him anything. He's, he knows right. already. How do we decorate this uh, tree? Well, we want to help you. You know, here. there's normally... I don't think you need to help. Yeah, okay, you're We're right. going to just keep you over there, Russell, but... You know, normally there are 12 days of Christmas, but pirates really, they're not that. They don't live 12 days. Yeah. Well, they might not live at 12 days, and also, <laughs> Short they don't want to work that hard. Okay. So, there you go. Captain Scrooge came up with his own version of, based on the seven seas, you know, he thought that would be kind of catchy. So, yes. so uh, could Christmas. you could you give them a little rendition of the pirate well, the seven se days of Christmas The seven days us. of Christmas, will you And I'm going to finish decorating his Oh, that's right, you get to work. Yeah. Now, um, you've got... Seven swords are swinging. Yeah. Six mermaids swimming. Five gold doubloons. Which we'll throw over at Russ. Oh. This is a doubloon? A it's doubloon. A, okay. Four eye patches, three earrings, two sea lions, and of course, if you'd like to place it on top, a <coughs> parrot in a pear tree or a palm tree. Or palm tree or whatever. This it's is a treat. Yeah. You want to put it on top? Get Beth, do the honors. Yeah, I think there Beth should now do watch this. Me. I, I literally knocked the thing over. I may at this point, but, uh, and, and, and then we'll be even. <clears throat> in my defense, all I did was walk past it. Well, I, well, it's I a didn't pirate. See you touch it. I was like, it's oh. a pirate palm tree. So you know, hey, there a, you go. Look at that. Oh, check it out. Yeah, that looks good. All right, folks. I mean, I know the tickets are selling like crazy. Yes. They are. And the yeah, other I know thing, they are. the other thing we haven't but, even mentioned, it yeah. is a dinner show. Oh yes. Oh, so come hungry. It's a four-course holiday feast. Um, yeah. I'm going to warn y'all, though, that there's so much food and it's great, but do not let him get too close to your plate or your <laughs> pork chop will disappear. Yeah, I know. I know. I've had this happen to me before and it's... Well, it's, we've replaced the pork chop with sugar cured. Well, <laughs> he's going to steal that, too. Okay. I'm I just saying. All the hype. Right. You better, like you better call Russell, soon. Right? Exactly. Yeah, you so, better call soon. Exactly. So, all right. On you. What? I, I think uh, that's a good luck. Right here. All right. I think he's that's ready. a good luck for you, Russell. Thank you. I'll be right back. Back.